What's up guys, Ethan here, and uh, I know I've already done a little walk around of my 2015 Focus ST, but I didn't have my keys on me at the time, and there's been a little, there's been a couple mods since then, so I figured this video would be a walk around of all of the mods that I've done so far. Uh, now you're probably expecting the usual stuff, like access port, intake, exhaust, blah 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 blah. Uh, I really haven't done a whole lot, and I also don't plan on ever getting an access port, at least for a while. Uh, I'll explain that later. So first mod would be the exhaust. This is from the downpipe back, so I have the stock catted downpipe. Replaced the stock resignator with a glass pack, and then deleted the muffler. These were the biggest tips that the exhaust shop had. I wanted way, way bigger. Uh, more of like blast pipe style, but they didn't have any in stock and Obviously you can tell They're not perfectly Even so I'm gonna get that fixed eventually, but for right now it was more of just for sound purposes I was tired of driving around really quiet uh, the next biggest mod Just small stuff. Of course you can't buy a fake Subaru and not put mud flaps on it So it's got mud flaps. It's got a turbo smart full vent to atmosphere blow-off valve uh, and then for the more smaller cosmetic stuff, it's got two dollars. This headlight tint was two bucks on eBay. Uh, I'll zoom in, it looks really bad. Um, but I more or less just wanted to test it to see if I liked the dark headlight look. And then the fog light tint, actually that stuff's pretty solid. That was like a dollar fifty uh, on, on eBay. And then I've got my clothing company's logo and a douchey banner at the top. Now let's go inside. I was talking before about how I had the ST1 package, but a lot of you guys don't know what that is, so I will go over it. Uh, the ST1 basically means you get the much smaller screen. It doesn't have like the Sony Sync cool stuff. It also comes with this regular shift knob, whereas I think the ST3 package, this is carbon fiber, this is carbon fiber, and this is carbon fiber. And no, it's not Subaru WRX garbage fake carbon fiber, it's real. Because uh, I went to buy those parts and they're way too expensive, but they mentioned that they are real 100% carbon fiber. Uh, you also don't get the Recaros, you get these cloth seats, which quite honestly I think are really ugly, but those will be getting not switched out, but changed. Uh, what I plan on doing, I don't know how expensive it is. Uh, but I don't see a lot of people doing this to newer cars. So you can see this material right here is just a regular cloth, nothing fancy. I'd like to get that done in suede instead of cloth with maybe a red stitch going around kind of the little arch up there just to kind of give it a nicer look. This is leather. I'd, I'd like to get this done suede with red stitching. Uh, I obviously I want to get the, the red in the carbon fiber shift knob with the red shift pattern. Uh, and I want to get the carbon fiber shift knob. There's really nothing to wrap carbon fiber in here because the, the it's so odd. Uh, I do want to get this LED instead of whatever the heck that is. Uh, and then SoCal Garage Works makes a steering wheel that this top leather part is carbon fiber and these inserts are suede with red stitching. It's very expensive but I think if I get everything else done it would look really clean. Um, but interior mods is pretty much it, besides like a suede dash mat. Uh, so I'll go ahead and I'll start the car up for you, so that you can hear the blow-off valve and the exhaust. Uh, and that's pretty much going to be it. Uh, I will not get an access port, it's not going to happen. I'm very satisfied with the way this car performs, and I'm not trying to void warranty. Not only not void warranty, even if it didn't void warranty, it's going to cause problems, right? Because you're going to, you have access to so much in just this little tiny piece. You're just going to want to keep going faster and faster and faster. And eventually that's going to cause problems. So I'd rather just not even give myself that option. Uh, not to mention the fact that I can't afford an access port at the moment. Um, but eventually later down the line, uh, some serious mods that I want to do. I want to do sway bars, uh, the rear torsion bo bar, and coilovers. I was gonna go bags uh, for more of like a stance look, but this car's got some serious uh, like roly-poly feel to it in the canyons, uh, and I don't really like that, so I kinda wanna beef up the suspension a little bit, and I need some stickier tires. These, with well, these Eagle F1s are complete garbage, at least the ones that I got, because I didn't buy this car new, I bought it used. This car slips 
like rear end wise real easily and I don't really like that uh, so definitely some new tires so let me go ahead and start this up for you I'll uh it's pretty loud so hopefully you can hear it from back here So that is the exhaust. And on a sound note, uh, you guys who have been here for a while know that I have this stuff, but some of you guys who are just coming across this video because I have a Focus ST now, don't know. In the trunk, oh, this is gonna totally get water spots over everything because I just washed the car. That's not supposed to be back there. Let me throw that away. I do have two CT Sounds 12s on a CT Sounds 1400.1 amp and my door speakers are running off of a JL 300 by 4 amp. So, for those of you who don't understand what, you know, all those terms mean, it means that the subwoofers are getting 1400 watts total, so 700 per sub, and my door speaker amp is pushing out 300 watts divided by 4 speakers. Actually, 6 because I have two tweeters. So do the math, each speaker's getting a decent amount of power. Car's really loud inside and out. That's just the way it is. So hope you guys, hope you guys like this video. If you did like it, please like it. If you dislike it, please dislike it. And if you really like it, add it to your favorites. I'll see you guys some other time.